if you had significant trauma when you were young, and it seems like you've had this dark cloud hanging over you like Pigpen and Charlie Brown ever since, you have probably become familiar with that concept that is reflected in the saying of, I'm just waiting for the other shoe to drop. That's me. It's hard to believe that I can achieve any kind of happiness that will last, that that other shoe will always drop and things will be crap. So it is hard to hope. It is hard to believe that life can be good. And if life even gives us a hint that it could be different and that we could be happy, we self-sabotage because we're afraid to believe that that could be so and we are still waiting for that other shoe to drop. So I have an idea. I am going to share a couple of photos of shoes. And in the first one, you will see a dirty, beat up boot, which is the kind of shoe we expect to drop. Maybe there's even shit on the sole of the shoe. This is what I think most of us expect. And I thought, why not retrain ourselves to think that the shoe that drops could be a beautiful, new, possibly expensive, and quite coveted shoe, like the pump, I guess. I will share. You know, we can retrain ourselves to think in a different way. And sometimes it takes something corny to get us there. So the next time you find yourself waiting for the other shoe to drop, replace that dirty old boot with that fabulous, expensive pump. It's odd, but so am I. Maybe it's worth giving a try. What do you think?